Hello, how's everybody doing? I'm sure everybody's watching the Oscars, or not everybody, but maybe some of you are. Um, I went to a friend's um, place earlier today. Um, he had invited me over, but I didn't stay the whole, through the whole Oscars. Anyway, this video is kind of not about the Oscars, but what happened to me to the Vaughn's. I, I was shocked, to be honest with you, I was completely shocked. Um, not, I, this has never happened to me ever, ever, so I thought I would share with you guys. Once again, this happened um, at the Vons, um, the Vons in Hollywood, um, on the corner of Virgil and Sunset, where Sunset, Virgil, and Hollywood meet, um, and I, I think diagonally there's like the Vista Theater. The reason why I went there too, so like that after I went there, um, I could go do my groceries at the Vons because there's this Vons that I go, that I like going to. That's where that's close to where my friend lives, and I like going there because I just think it's a nicer Vons. There's a Vons here in Echo Park too, but it's kind of like really small, and so I don't have everything. And it's just I don't know. I just like going to that one better. The owls are bigger, so um. But yeah. Anyway, um, so I went to my friend, so I didn't stay there through the whole Oscars show because I left, I don't know if it was in the middle, but I left when Ben Midler started singing and I think that was like around 8 o'clock, so I just kind of, I couldn't stay there longer as much as I wanted to because obviously I had to work tomorrow and there were errands that I needed to run, like, you know, I needed to go to the grocery, but I had forgotten my credit card at home. Um, my thing is I like, I never really like carrying cash on, I was tend to carry my credit card just because like it's easier I don't need to carry the exact change and you know I could just pay at the end of the month whatever I pay or whatever I use um, during that month but I had forgotten my card so then I I had forty dollars on me so I really needed to leave it myself to what I could buy I could only buy forty dollars worth of groceries but then um, so I thought I you know I didn't think there was more than forty dollars worth, but I guess when I went to the checkout, um, it, it hit forty dollars. But then there was still stuff that hadn't been checked um, or it's, or on um, scan. So when I saw that, I realized I only had forty dollars, and I told the cashier and I told her, you know what, um, I only have forty dollars on me. So if you could please um, don't scan those and maybe like you know take away from whatever you've checked, you know you've scanned. So you know I just could only afford forty dollars worth and she's like okay no problem and I'm all like you know I'm really sorry and you know it was really awkward um, but there was this gentleman behind me in line and to my surprise I was like really really shocked and he said oh you know it's okay like you know just put you know just he could buy that stuff but you know you could charge it to my card and at that point I didn't know how to react. I was like shocked. I was like really surprised. Nothing like that has ever happened to me. Maybe something like that has happened, but not exactly that same thing where like, you know, somebody pays for, you know, the rest of whatever you couldn't afford for. And I was like really, I, I, at that point, I, I didn't know how to react. I didn't know what to say. I didn't know what to think. It was just, I was in awe and like, it was just, uh, I was just deeply touched and um, it, it, mean, it, it even brought me to tears because like, I mean, I didn't cry there in front, but just like within me, like it was just really touching. I mean, I just, it's really nice to see how there's people out there like that. And um, I felt so little because I didn't feel like I deserved such act of kindness. It's not that I'm a bad person, but I just feel like I don't deserve it. And I was just really touched and um, at that point all I could say to the gentleman was, you know, thank you very much, um, I really appreciate it. Um, I, I just didn't know how, what else to say and, um, and then I left and I said again, you know, thank you very much, I thank you from the bottom of my heart and I left. I just hope I didn't seem, I, I hope I just didn't seem um, ungrateful because um, but now that I'm thinking back what I should have done, I should have given him my phone number and then I should have said, you know what, here's my phone number and my name. If you ever need a favor, if you ever need a, like, if you ever stuck anywhere, give me a call and I'll go there to help you because I'll never forget this big favor, amazing favor that you're doing for me. But I couldn't, like I said, I couldn't, I didn't, I didn't know how to react, I didn't know what to think or say at that point. So. 
I'm taking this opportunity to say this to that good Samaritan that helped me out today. Um, even though I don't know, he might never ever see this video ever in his whole life, or maybe he will. But I'm extending out and I want to say thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. That was really... That, that's just... there's no word. I can't thank you enough. Um, and let me personally tell you this, that if you're ever in need of anything or if you're ever stuck or if you ever need a favor, um, let me know and I'll help you. Um, you could send me a message if you're watching this video. Um, and I hope you are, but if not, that's cool too. But I just want to put you out there and just show people how there's really amazing people still out there. And um, it's really, it's really refreshing. And thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. And may you be blessed, you know. And I hope, you know, somehow you get repaid this in one way or another if I don't myself do it. So... Thank you very much again, um, Good Samaritan at Vons today. So, YouTubers, um, thank you very much for watching this video and for listening. And if you guys ever have any stories out there like that, please share. It's really nice to hear these things. Um, so, yeah, so let me know if I did the correct thing by, you know, um, I don't know, because I guess I don't want to seem um, ungrateful and... I don't know if I did well just by saying thank you and have not and not having offered anything else in return or another fate, you know. Um, so what would you do in this case? How would have you reacted if you were in my shoes? And um, so yeah. And once again, that's my story and my amazing, shocking story for today. And I was really surprised. Um, and you know thanks for watching and i just thought that this would be something to share with you guys so that's that and i hope everybody had a good sunday i hope everybody enjoyed the oscars those of you that watched it um i don't know if it's still going on right now but anyway take care everybody and have a blessed week and um so may you always be blessed and um yeah sometimes i think that you know, I'm being watched from up there or somewhere, um, you know, that, you know, that these things happen. It's just, um, I was just deeply touched. So, okay, take care, everybody. Until next time. Bye.